Good morning, Grandma Prepper here. Little pantry update. I've been grabbing things from everywhere, closets and under the beds and, you know, piles in the living room and piles in the dining room and my working pantry and clearing space and it's coming together really nicely. I'm very happy. Of course, I have to show you my kitchen sink. It's still in here. <laughs> um, I did get these shelving units. They're the IKEA PAX units. I got them in place in each of the corners of the room. As you can see, the one on the right is grains, like rice and flour. So anything made from rice and flour and corn are on that shelf plus you know desserts snacks clearly i need to buy more shelves to put them in there and that's okay i'll get that done um you know i've got toilet paper stacked to the roof literally and that's not even half of it so the rest of it's going to come up from the garage this shelving unit i opted to use for my long-term storage you know peanut butter powder meat veggies um now mind you i started buying from four patriots almost a decade ago and um i got one of their 72 hour survival food kits and um i liked the food and i liked the coffee so i ordered you know, a few one-year kits and, you know, some fruit and veggie kits and, you know, all their extras and all their little stuff. I pretty much have everything that they put out. Um, and I love all their solar stuff. Again, here's their little, you know, solar kick. Um, has a little panel with it and you can, you know, in the day and age of electronics, you can charge just about anything on it um that has a battery a rechargeable battery and um you know like a lot of the in the northwest we don't have direct sunlight so a lot of their stuff takes forever to charge so if i can just you know charge one device and then plug in all of the flashlights and all that to charge because four patriots thankfully has three ways to charge everything um, so anyway, this closet, you can actually see the closet again. Um, 99% of this closet is still craft. You know, I'm switch, still switching from this room being my craft room to my proper pantry. My water and my buckets are going to be in this room. I got to take those shelves down and repair the walls. As you can see here, I've got the 1500 and the 1800. Um, this one is the 1800, and that one's the 1400 or 1500 um, watt solar generators. And they have really big panels, they're really nice. You can actually charge your refrigerator. Had to do that once, it sucked, but it was okay because I had these. And that's a bucket of sugar right there. I don't remember what comp... Oh, it's from Augustine Farms. It's a five-gallon bucket of sugar. But anyway. Yeah. And yes, my carpets, they didn't come clean. Most of the stains came out. But that one did not. Um, Or those two did not. And the carpet cleaner that I had to use to actually get those stains out right there. um, Removed the color in my carpet. So I won't be using that product again, but it was really nice to get those stains out. Um, and again, here, whatever was spilled in the carpet, um, when I cleaned the carpet, it came out real nice and easy, but it took the color too. I don't know what my boy did, but this used to be his room and then I turned it into my craft room and now it is becoming my beautiful, beautiful proper pantry. Now... Those paper towels are going into the garage. 
and all the toilet paper that's in the garage is coming up here. And those paper towels and all the paper towels in my bedroom are actually going into the garage. We don't use paper towels upstairs or napkins. So paper towels and napkins will be in the garage. Um, I'll leave a few bags of toilet paper downstairs in the garage for the downstairs bathroom, but we don't use that bathroom much. So it, um, it doesn't go through a lot of paper. So three bags of the Costco toilet paper. These ones here, three of them will last all year. So we'll just leave three of them down there. That way I don't have to come back up for a year. The other bathrooms on the other hand get upstairs get used a lot. So they use a lot more paper. Anyway, I just wanted to share with you, you know, everything that I had accomplished in the last couple of days in here. And, um, yeah, it's, it's coming in along nicely. I know my OCD is going out crazy. Um, but eventually it'll be okay. It'll look great in here. All this extra stuff will be out, including these boxes. I'm using these boxes to, I pack them up downstairs, bring the box up and then unload the box on the shelves. And, um, you would not believe how many times I have filled those boxes. Sometimes the products are so heavy, I can only put like four or five in a box, like that coconut oil. I can only carry four or five at a time. So that was the only thing in the box. <laughs> All right. Take care, guys. Have fun. Enjoy.